Hello again. It's Wednesday, May 31st, 2023. This is Journal TV and I'm Jerry Clark. It's time for the news. It became a memorable Business Appreciation Day celebration Tuesday evening with Deputy Secretary of Commerce and Trade James Campos showing up as guest speaker at Mountain Gateway Community College. The Allegheny Highlands Chamber of Commerce and Tourism and the Allegheny Highlands Economic Development Corporation's event was well attended. The Allegheny Journal was on hand for the evening for photos and two videos, both of which are now on the Allegheny Journal's Facebook page. Earlier today, the Allegheny Foundation released the final results of the highly successful Give Local Allegheny Highlands event, which concluded on May 23rd. Over $500,000 was raised for local nonprofit groups in the Highlands. 33 nonprofit groups participated. There were 381 donors and 72 local high school seniors also voted for their favorite organizations. There's much more about all this right now on the AlleghenyJournal.com. The annual Cork and Pork Festival is set this weekend in Covington, and among the assets of the event will be the performances of many local bands. The bands and their playing times for both Friday and Saturday, as well as locations, are now available on the Allegheny Journal's Facebook page. And now a word from our sponsor. The Allegheny Highlands Community Services Organization held a brief ceremony earlier today at the McAllister Memorial Presbyterian Church in Covington to add to the well-known Cope Food Pantry with more than 500 donated items. Additionally, the organization honored the Allegheny Cruisers Car Club for being the top local food item donator during its May Food Drive event. The City of Covington has released detailed information about various road closures in conjunction with the Cork and Pork Festival this weekend. That information is now available on AlleghenyJournal.com. And we'll be right back. And now for regional obituaries. Clifford Vandeveer, 60, of Lexington, passed away Thursday. Kenneth Helmick, 78, of Rafine, died Saturday. Daphne Fitzgerald, 39, of Covington, passed away May 24th. William Crouch, Jr., 72, of Buena Vista, died Monday. Martha Varner, 83, of Monterey, died Wednesday. And Jacqueline Underwood, 88 of Selma, passed away Tuesday. More information on all obituaries may be found on AlleghenyJournal.com. And let's check out the local weather forecast. On Thursday, it should be partly cloudy, high of 85 and low of 56. On Friday, mostly sunny, high of 87 and low of 58. And on Saturday, partly cloudy, high of 88 and a low of 59 degrees. And that's the way it is on Wednesday, May 31st, 2023. More stories, photos, videos, and interviews are available 24-7, 365 on AlleghenyJournal.com, YouTube, and on our soaring Facebook page. Thanks very much for watching Journal TV.